Hello everyone, welcome to another video where I style new clothes. These are all very like same aesthetic muted browns, greys, whites, creams. Hopefully you can see the vision and personally I want some cute fits for autumn so if you want to get some inspiration keep on watching. May as well start with the fit I have on currently. It is a little black vest and then a denim midi skirt. Sorry the angle you can't really see the length of it but cute and then this very impractical brown belt which matches the brown boots. These will be seen a lot in this video. They're so beautiful. I don't know how Rogue is pairing like blue, denim, brown and black together but I love it. We're only going to use these clothes that are on the rack right now so we've got to be creative but anyway I'm going to keep this vest on and try it put a different skirt change it up a little the fabric of this skirt is like capro cupro um so it does wrinkle very easily but it's so beautiful if it's nicely ironed which it is not but little black bag black little hat i'm adding this necklace to add a bit of a statement on my neck but this is the fit i actually love this this hat is definitely too big but it's fine, we're just gonna pretend. You could definitely add like cute little black kitten heels, which I definitely don't have, but I think the boots make it more daytime, which I feel like the hat's giving off those vibes. I want to add like a black, black sunny. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Starting off strong, I'm actually loving this. Yeah. Yeah. Ooh, ooh, ooh. I'm thinking this could be cute. Oh, wait a second. This is cute. I'm loving this vibe. <laughs> Not the intention at all, but add a little extra fit in there. Oh, it feels so cute. So simple but so good in my opinion. This is what I'm saying when you don't need to have like fun colours. It's just like how you wear the pieces and how you style them I guess. <laughs> but let's let's finish it actually. Cute little cream off the shoulder number. Oh, it feels so cute. Wait one second. Oh So cute, and then the bag. Surely, surely. Yeah, yeah. This is by far my favorite fit so far. This is. Do they have pockets? No, they don't have pockets. That is a bum. I've never worn this, so I'm learning with you. Oh, is that cute? A little peeking underneath. No. Um, but yeah, it's like a fur, fur little vest. So cute. Brown bag can never go wrong. Grey sport. Little crochet cream headband. Boots, of course. We're gonna keep the score because it's really it's really working for me right now. We're gonna change it to this little top, which definitely changes the vibes. This is giving headphones energy. black knit. I kind of want to show the buttons off so I'm like bringing it out of it. Yeah this is cute. I kind of want like a black headband. Let me try to find that. Do you know how Emma Chamberlain had that whole video dedicated to black turtlenecks? Well I definitely recommend like she's not wrong you can style black turtlenecks a million different ways this being one of them. But I love like a mini skirt with like lots of layers on top. So cute. Honestly, you could wear stockings with this too. I am going to play around with that later on, but I'm not really bothered with the whole skirt going on here. But yes, this is super cute. Oh wait. <laughs> We're going to keep this 
black knit and then add the skirt. I'm thinking cold vibes for this. <laughs> Clearly, I want to add fun like jewelry to play around because, yeah, need I say more? No, I don't like that. And I don't know if we need the puffer. I think it's a bit, it's a bit much, but I do like the stockings. A lot going on. Um, shall we try, shall we try her? Ew, 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 ew. You know, this is part of the journey because this, this is objectively not cute. We're gonna move on past this. What can we do to make this look cute? I could do this. You know what, we're gonna go with it. You know what, I don't think it's bun and vibes. But I think it could work. How's that go with this now? No. Still no man. Stop trying to make it work. Not my favorite, honestly, but it will do. I guess this vibe is like all black, all black accessories, silver jewelry, but just like a one pop colored patterned skirt. Also, can you tell I'm sweating? Anyway, let's move on to something cute, hopefully. I love this dress. I wish I had like navy stockings because I don't think these are the cutest, but it's perfectly like preppy, but also like muted, like not doing too much. I mean, like 60s mod, mod, I don't know how to say the word, with the cut and the collar and pockets, the blocking, like I love blocking. I think that's what I'm coming to realize. Maybe I could do without the headband. I think the hair also works quite well with this style of dress. Cute, cute. Let's move on. Okay, I feel like I'm gonna laugh at this when I look at it back, but in the moment, right this second, I like it, and that's all that matters. <laughs> yeah, we might have to reconsider this, but for now, we're liking it. Let's break down what's going on with this fit. We've got a blue distressed cap, navy blue vest, puffer with the hood, of course. <laughs> a purple little corset off the shoulder, like, oh. Ooh. And we're back to the beginning with the blue denim midi skirt. I love the color coordination. It doesn't really make sense with the weather. Like, is it summer? Is it winter? Let's zip this up real quick. The whole blue going on here. I love how it like just chops off right there. Like it's perfect length. And then if you're getting hot, you just Oh, I don't know if all three work together, like I think you may need to get rid of one, but we're just having fun here, okay? I think I may need some sleeves with this, with this jacket, so let's try some sleeve options. Is it too much navy for like one fit? I love monochrome fit though. Girl. I kind of love all the blue, but I want to add a pop of colour. Why are there gloves in that? A little fun. Yes, yes. This is like, I got it for $5 in Melbourne. It's so cute. A little burnt orange hat. The sun is rapidly going down, but we are not stopping. We've got a few more looks that I want to show you. This is... Cute in itself, honestly, but I want to add this number. This coat was actually my mum's from the 80s, 90s. I'm not sure. I love it so much. It is like definitely like a boxy fit, but that is honestly why I love it. I feel like you don't see things without buttons or something like down the front. Like it's all shifted to the side, but I love it. Yeah, I feel like it only needs that top button, honestly, and then you can just have a little peek of the purple underneath. Moving on, I think I'm going to do, I want to, I really want to make this work. I don't know quite how. I love the color of this. So we're going to keep that out with this jacket on. Oh wait, got to bring out the color. You, no hat. What am I doing with that hat on? And then I'm going to change to jeans. I know how I feel about the different double denim going on, like the different shades. But I like, I like a little pop of 
collar going on. I got a headband as well. I feel like this is a lot cuter. I just changed the bottoms for white pants. I feel like it just ties in the collar much nicer. So that is that. You probably like can't even see my pants with the background, but cute. It's all about experimentation, playing with it. You really don't have to hit the nail on the head every first go. So just you know, you can start ugly and come to a masterpiece like this. <laughs> And that is the end of this video. I hope you enjoyed. Sorry the lighting is so terrible towards the end. But didn't get to do, try this on. That's right. Or this. What? I'm sure there'll be another time. I hope you enjoyed. And I'll see you in my next one very shortly. Bye. Bye.